I am Chris Bird with the Bird's Eye View. I <sighs> just got done watching Guerrero Mayweather Clinic. What can I say? Well, talk about Guerrero first. You know, he, he tried. You know, it, and you know, probably watching tape coming off the Berto fight, it looked easy. And, you know, and I put you know a plan for for both of them pre-fight video of, of Guerrero. Make it rough if you get close, you know, get close and get him to the ropes. He, I mean, he had him, he got him to the ropes, but it, that wasn't even easy, you know, trying to stay out and box a little bit. Left hander can throw you off, that wasn't easy either. I mean, it's, just, it's a hard task. What can I say? Guerrero did his best, and you know, you know, you know, he got just outworked, out maneuvered our thought, out everything in the fight. And, but props to him, you know, he hung in there and he fought. So, and he had a great opportunity, you know, a good chance to fight one of the greats, maybe of all time, one of the greats. And what can I say about Floyd Mayweather? I mean, that, that was straight clinic. Year off boxing, 36 years old, and you wait for him to falter a little bit, you know, thinking, okay, he's off, he gonna, you know, be off somewhere. Man, he, Put another great performance. I'm talking about hand speed, um, the lead right, the movement, smart. Every time he got, every time he got to the, to the ropes, he grab one arm, spin, and what is taught? Get back to the middle of the ring. Get back to the middle of the ring, so you don't get pushed back to the ropes anymore. Thinking that Guerrero gonna uh, grind him when he get to the ropes, but he was winning those sequences sometimes when he was on the ropes. I mean, just smart. You think about Floyd. He's on his back foot but leaning forward. And like I was saying in the, in the pre-fight video, he'd give it to you, take it away, counter. And then he made Guerrero think. And once you're in, in, in boxing, if I got you thinking, I could do anything I want. And then Floyd got to a point where he had Guerrero thinking. Guerrero really doesn't know what to throw because if you throw, you're going to get counter. That's what you're thinking. And, and like I tweeted out, if Floyd Mayweather threw combinations – like a Roy Jones, or like myself, I threw combinations. I I I put 10, 12 punches on you if if I can get them going. Man, they abandoned him from the sport. He, he he's that good right now. And I I look at you know all the the I put all these factors together as far as age, time off, and he still looked that good. That kid's just a talented kid. Like I said, I think before I seen him when he was 15 years old when I came back from the Olympics, me and my wife, and. I was an Olympic silver medalist, and I was getting the key to the city in Kalamazoo, Michigan, at a boxing show. See this kid fight, and I was in awe. And he was 15, and I'm like, man, is he's the second best amateur I've ever seen at 15 years old. So, and now he's 36, and he's still amazing me with just the movement, the speed, the the boxing intelligence, which is hard to come by in a lot of fighters. He'll just fight. He's intelligent. He think his way through. Then he make you think. And once he gets you thinking, he got you. So props to, you know, both fighters always. But, you know, big props to Floyd Mayweather. Great skill set. And uh, check out the Birds I View this Thursday. We have Shane Mosley, a two-parter. Great interview, great talk. And he got his fight coming up May 18th. And check it out.